Yeah. I wish um, there was smell of vision because the smell here is amazing. <laughs> it just smells like a backyard barbecue. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or like a cookout. A cookout. Yeah, so we're, we're separating the two channels. One channel is going to be Zaid's Fun Factory, which we're going to continue to do. We have a lot of uh, pranks lined up, so stay yeah. tuned for that. Mm -hmm. And we're separating everything else other than the prank videos. We're creating a new channel called Zaid's Food Quest. Yeah. So please take a look at that channel. Support us. Um, we're trying to grow that channel yeah. as a separate channel. So, so yeah, share, share, take a look at it. Throw a like up and subscribe. Please subscribe to the new channel. Yeah. Um, but we're going to continue Zade's Fun Factory. With um, pranks and Bush Boy pranks. Yeah, and, and just a lot of fun and stuff. And also falling objects. Yeah, just, just a lot of, it's going to be just a fun uh, fun factory, <laughs> basically. Much. But but up at anything other than that is going to be on uh, Zade's Food Quest. So get, you, let's get ready to go check out some street food. Yeah, try some street food and um, I mean this is as authentic as you can get there's no tourists here whatsoever it's all Moroccan nobody speaks English but um, we're here to try some street food we apologize for the background noise because we're actually on the street um, so we're gonna try just about everything you have here um, can we get two racks of these uh -huh. Um, I guess one rack of these, yeah. one of these, and I guess, um, how many, do you have an, enough for three sandwiches? Three? Can, you can translate it if you want. By the way, guys, um, my nephew, Zaid's cousin, slash cameraman, slash translator is helping us out today. Thank you very much, Mohammed. Yeah. If you could just translate what I just said. قال لك شويه من هادو اه اه وشويه من هادوك ديال الفخد وقال لك هادي واش تقدر تجي فيها شي ثلاثه ساندويتشات هادوك ال 3 3 3 كاين جي يس كاين دو اوكي ام سو وات شنو النوع ديال العطريه اللي كتستعمل بالنسبه لهاد ال بزاف ديال تو ميني سبايسز اند ذات ااا مثلا بحالاش جينجر كيومن كيومن يا شنو قور كاين كامل بلدي الزعتر اند لوكال لوكال كيومن اوكي وات وات كايند اوف ام ا سوسيج از ذس وات كايند اوف ميت از ان ذس سوسيج 
كان كاين واش اللحم ديال بقري ولا غنمي؟ لا هذا كان. اتس تشوركيز تشوركيز. تشوركيز؟ اوكي. ذات ساوندز جود. But for him, no hot sauce. Uh, for for Zaid, no hot sauce. No, no. Yeah, and um, for for I don't know Mohammed, do you like hot sauce? Uh, doesn't matter. Yeah, just put some hot. Put everything on, on our sausages. Okay. So, yeah. He's actually giving us permission to check out what's going on here. So this is. Wow, this is great. I love the fact that these chicken wings aren't fried and they're, they're actually grilled. It's a much healthier choice. So now we're just going to go across the street and get some water bottles while this is cooking. All right, guys. So we're here. This goes about eighty dollars, which is about eight dollars for all this food. We got three sausage sandwiches. Yep. Um, and also um, one for me that doesn't have any seasoning. Like, and then we have. It does have seasoning, but. We have the kefta, which is ground lamb. Yeah. And we got the sauce. Right. And they gave us sauces for that, with the um, the grilled chicken wings, which are my favorite. And. And also these sandwiches right here. Ooh. Um, yeah, some onions. onions. Alright guys. So you guys ready to eat? Yep. Okay. So, what do you want to try one first? Let's try just try the chicken first and then tell me what you think. Okay. What do you like about it? So I see the seasoning on top, as you can see, this um, seasoning right here, and I love the smoke flavor, like the, the grilled, I mean not grilled, but... The charcoal flavor? Yeah, and it, it adds a lot. And also, um, the chicken, it's really moist, like, mm. you can even see it. Yeah. So, oh, by the way, yeah, sorry. Yeah. Let me introduce you to Mohammed, the guy behind the camera, my nephew, his age cousin. He was nice enough to really help us today get this shot done. Um, also, before we really begin, I just want to let you know Zade's Fun Factory, yeah. we're going to still do videos on Zade's Fun Factory, but they're going to be strictly prank videos and fun videos like uh, also, Bushman um, videos. Yeah, also mystery videos. And mystery videos. And this channel is strictly for food reviews and eating. <clears throat> so what do you think about it? Perfect. It's like, um, as they said, the, it's not bad. Mm -hmm. um, it's easy to chew. Yes, mm -hmm. moist. And sure. um, very tasty. Also the, the spices, the seasoning. Mm -hmm. I really like it. And uh, meanwhile, it's uh, crunchy uh, on the outside. That's exactly why I like it, because it got the crunchy outer, <clears throat> and then with the texture of the soft inner, you get the two textures. Yeah, exactly. And it's, re it's really great. And uh, the fact that it's grilled and it's healthy is super important to me. Mm -hmm. It's not deep fried. In the US, we're used to the deep fried chicken wings. They're very, uh, there's not that many places that sell grilled chicken wings. And I'll have you know that this is probably the only guy in the city of Tamara, where we're at, that sells chicken wings, just chicken wings. And we yes. pretty much buy this all day long, like the sandwiches. Yeah, but I've never had the kefta. <coughs> Excuse me. I never had the kefta. You guys want to try the kefta? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So this is ground that's, lamb. That's with, how it looks inside. Yep. You expect and that. And they use the same spices. 
for the wings and for this. Mm. Mm. This is really good. Yeah. I'm getting them. Um, it actually melts in your mouth. Mm -hmm. Mm. Yeah. Hey, this is good. Like. You're getting half on your mouth there. <laughs> yeah. Like. Let me wipe you off. Uh, yeah, it pretty much is just melts on your mouth. And like again, I really like the seasoning. And mm -hmm. this time it got like a little bit more like a little bit crunch, like right here. The spot has a little bit of crunch. And then, and once I bite it, it's like so tender, like it mm -hmm. just melts. Yeah, definitely. And and this is actually really see, good. You can also see even inside it, right here. It's like it's like a little, I think like brown. I'm really I'm really enjoying this. I'm definitely coming back and to get this. And the sauce is pretty. Mm. Just to let you guys know, we have a house here, and Zade stays here three months out of the year. Um, I come for a few weeks, but then I have to get back to the United States. But there are no tourists here. Just to let you know, nobody speaks English. Pretty much nobody. So that's why we had to bring Mohammed. He was nice enough to come and help us out. Um, I mean, it, it, it's very hard when Zaid actually speaks it, but it's very broken, and uh, <laughs> he understands a hundred percent of it. But he, when he speaks it, it's kind of broken. So <laughs> soon enough, he'll be my designated translator. <laughs> yeah. But we've been we've been living here for probably uh, 10, 11 years now, yeah. and we love it. If you look on the street here, there are absolutely no tourists. People actually stop in the street and look at me like, what am, what am I doing here? Yeah, yeah, like a stranger. We're right outside of Rabat, and it's very close, about a 30-minute walk to the beach. Mm -hmm. So it's a really great location. And, I mean, I, I love it here. So this part of, um, of the day, it's very busy here. And uh, uh, people go out to buy some, uh, for example, foods and groceries for the house. And it's really busy, as you can see in the background. Um, so it's a lot of movement here, and we are looking like strangers right now because we are using a lot of uh, like strange things. Yeah, we got we got the cameras set them. up, yeah, yeah. and you know it's kind of not normal for this yeah. kind of area. It's not normal for them. There's and, no uh, tourists here. So. Yeah, but that's why. Um, so, but uh, anyway, they are very. Um, um, warm, warm people, and uh, yeah. they won't come to us, um, and uh, we appreciate them for that. Yeah, I mean, we love here. They, they couldn't be any nicer. The people here. Sorry for our background noise. There's, there's like non-stop moped and diesel engines going back and forth. It's just the nature of the beast. We're, we're doing a street food review, and that's what you get. And so I really like this kefta. Yeah. I mean, I really and like it. Add the sauce, it makes it a little oily. And I think it's, it's like a like tomato-based yeah, kind like of a, sauce. It's like yeah, a, little, a little seed. A little I sweet. For eight bucks. For eight dollars? I yeah. didn't, didn't even check out these sandwiches. Let's, let's oh. show them the sandwiches. Oh, yeah. All right, so here's this, the sandwich. It's got sausage, oh, sausage meat inside. Yep. And we add some onion to it. So you want to add some, want to take a bite? We'll add some onion. Let me grab some onion, put the onion here. By the way, we did hand sanitize our, our fingers before we started this. Because, Off camera. Yeah. So just to let you know, so you don't get corona. Yeah. Alright, take a bite, see? Tell them what Mm. Mm. So for eight bucks, you got how that can you beat food? this? Mm -hmm. Chicken wings, pepper, beef sandwiches. Man, I'm really enjoying this. Yeah. And especially the meat and the bread. And let me get some onion here. This has a lot of crunch, like from the onion. Mm. Yeah, and yeah. also the meat, the meat is like, it got like that smoke flavor. And also it's like so tender, just melts in your mouth. If you look behind me, you can definitely see the, the, the smoke, smoke smoke from the um, the grill. That, that the, the meat absorbs that, that, that flavor. It's just amazing. Mm -hmm. yeah. I wish um, there was smell-o-vision because the smell here is amazing. <laughs> It just smells like a backyard barbecue. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or like a cookout. A cookout. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's awesome. I mean, I'm super excited for this channel uh, launch. Um, but we're, we are going to post this on Zay's Fun Factory as the last food video. And moving forward on Zay's Fun Factory, it's going to be strictly uh, prank videos. Don't worry, we're still going to keep posting videos, uh, prank videos, even here in Morocco. We're, they, we got to keep it a little mild. I don't know how they're going to react to some. We're not going to do a Bushman video for sure. Yeah. I, I don't know the how well that would go over. Yeah, this is amazing. Mm -hmm. I mean, we're literally on the street. So, I mean, it's just so cool. You not exciting? Mm -hmm. I just love it. It's just, there's so much color here. It's so animated. There's so much going on. There's, I mean, there, it's just movement, left and right. It's, it's, it's just exciting to be here. And the house that we have is right on the marketplace. When you look over the balcony, and I'll put a shot right here of the marketplace. So that's the marketplace that we, we watch every evening. It's fun, it's noisy. I mean, that's the reason why we chose it. It's in the center of everything. It's yeah. not on the outskirts, we're just in the mix. <laughs> I love this sauce though. I can't believe this costs $8. Like in the US, one sandwich would be like $8. Yeah. Lamb here is cheap, it's supposed to be. In the US, lamb is super expensive. Yeah. And beef is cheap. Not cheap, but cheaper. But here, lamb is really cheap. Like, like even in, you know, aid. Like, there is like, so much sheep just like hanging around on those like, broken. Mm -hmm. And then they're like, just like bodies everywhere. And then, and then you see like flies landing on them. <laughs> How much days they are. And, and and then, and then you're cooking, and you eat at home, and then, and then you're like, your stomach is just great. <laughs> <laughs> you're funny. You're enjoying this, is it? Mm -hmm. Oh. Just to know, I'm a big slob. <laughs> okay. I mean, it doesn't just fall out. Oh, shoot! You can't really see, but behind the cameras, there's people watching and stuff as they walk by. It's kind of funny. Mm, yeah. You think we're like, you know, like not normal people. Like, what are these guys doing? Yeah. It's okay. It's okay. I'm not scared of them. It makes for good content. <laughs> I really like this stuff, though. I really do. Yeah, it's, it, it's, it tastes good. Yeah. It's, it's, it's the, one of the best that I've had here. I haven't had kept a, with this much flavor. I mean, not just the flavor, it's, the, it's not dry at all. Mm -hmm. it, it's, and it's got that moisture and then the outside has yeah. is, is, is got that texture. It's mm -hmm. in between. And along mm -hmm. with that smoke flavor, the combination of all three. And the, also the adding, the, adding to that with the spices. Yeah, it literally melts in your mouth. Mm -hmm. So which one was your favorite, right? Out of the three here? Well, it looks like the kefta here. My favorite. Go on. Probably like. I like them all. I, I don't. I can't pick a favorite. My favorite is the, you know, this. This is my favorite. Blink. <laughs> so this is the guy who is owning the, the little store. And you can just see what, the smoke. What's his name? Isham. His name is Isham. Yeah. So I hope it, I hope you enjoyed the video. And by the way, we're just um we're not ending Zade's Fun Factory. We're just um we're, this is just the last food review in Zade's Fun Factory. And if you want to see more videos, make sure to like, subscribe, add a comment, and hit the notification bell, and I'll see you next episode. Bye!